Anyway, I'm Alex Eldridge, and I've been on my Plexus journey for a little over six years. Thanks. I grew up in this company. I thought I love you too. I see a lot of my, my Plexus moms sitting in the front rows here. <laughs> but I've also had the unique privilege to see this company go from this little underdog to this. And it blows my mind every day. I've also had the ability to see all the different platforms over the years, all the different back offices, and I have to tell you, this is incredible. With the help of so many of our amazing ambassadors, what we've created is truly beyond my wildest dreams. This is what's gonna take us to the next level. It's gonna take Plexus to the next five levels. And what's gonna help you be strategic with your business. Strategic with your business. You're gonna hear me say that a lot. When we initially started this process, we really had one main question we wanted to answer. What do I need to do today? Where do I need to focus? Who do I need to call? Where am I at right now? How can I help my team? With our current system, you have to figure that out, right? You have to figure out what it is I want to do today. I then have to go pull reports, sort Excel spreadsheets. So for those of us who are not Excel gurus like Nikki Hinkle, it's going to be kind of difficult, right? Well, what we've done is we've brought the information to you. We've broken it down in a way that everyone should be able to understand. So, your dashboard. This is your control center. And the first thing you see when you log in are your KPIs, your key performance indicators. You have your subscription status. If it's on, thumbs up. If it's off, thumbs down. It also shows your next order date, PV of that order, and you can manage it right there. You also have your current PV, your points and rank, as well as how many new ambassadors you've brought in this month. Now, the first time an ambassador logs in, these KPIs will show detailed descriptions of what each one is. What is the subscription? What is PV? What are points? You'll then have to click OK, got it, in order to continue, right? I agree. I think this is something that's, that's really going to help our new ambassadors get started in the right direction from day one. It's one of the many small things that you're going to see throughout your back office that have a huge impact. And if you ever forget something, we have these handy information buttons. Just click the button, it'll tell you all about that section. Right? So now if you ever get a question that you don't know the answer to, Click the button, you can still sound like you know what you're talking about. So, now, the next part we're going to look at is... So below that, we have a quick snapshot of your business. You have customers. How many have active subscriptions? How much PV do I have, and where is it coming from? You then have ambassadors. Click ambassadors, you get the same type of information. How many points do I have this month? How many points did I have last month? How many points do I need to get to my next, uh, my next rank, my, my goal, right? <laughs> you see a lot of goal-oriented things everywhere in here. Then everything else on the dashboard is important information like your Leaders Retreat Contest Tracker, Consistency Club, and quick links that will take you to new and exciting features that I wish I had all day to show you, but Tarl said no, so. We're not gonna do that. So, lastly, you have your main navigation bar off to the left showing my business, training center, which is really cool, incentives and recognition, as well as sharing plexus and, of course, shopping. Who doesn't like shopping? Yeah, my wife does too. Um, <laughs> so, if you open my business, the first thing you're gonna see is ambassador growth. So, let's take a look at that. Right? Now again, everything in here is designed to provide you with the information you need to be strategic with your business. Again, you have KPIs at the top that show you how many ambassadors you, you have, as well as how many have left. How many ambassadors have actually canceled their accounts? So not just inactive, but ambassadors that have left, so true attrition. How many of us have said, 
my team brought in 10 new people last month. This month my points stayed the same. How can this be? This is gonna help you show that, help you see that. Then the graph shows you a full 13 month history, right? So you can see where you were this time last year, which can help you plan for maybe some of the slower months or show you where the bigger months are, the months where you really need to ramp up your efforts to get it strong. This is also separated out into level one growth and team growth. We really wanted to show you, right, your activity versus your team's activity. And this is gonna help a lot of people. There's also these little events stars where, that show you where convention is, leaders retreat, Super Saturday, and so on are, so you can see how those can affect your growth. Below that, we have sort and report. Yeah, this is something I'm really, really excited about. Now you can sort with just one or two clicks to identify the key areas of your business without having to use Excel. So, yeah, so for those of us who are not great with Excel, this is huge. With the guidance of many of our ambassadors, we've selected some of the most important indicators to help you target key areas of your business. Welcome pack purchases, new ambassadors with no activities, so zero PV, zero customer enrollments, ambassador enrollments, and so on. Cancellations, both pending and complete. So it gives you a chance to try to bring you back. We've also separated out into separated this out into levels. So one through three, four through seven, and of course all levels. Now, for those of you who are Excel gurus, we have the Nikki Hinkle button, <laughs> where you can still export your full genealogy. Sorry, Nikki, it was Sarah's idea to pick on you. Here's what I think the greatest part about this is. You can expand each line and get a quick snapshot of each of your ambassadors. If I then click View Team, you're now looking at their business. It's showing you an in-depth level. So this is gonna show you an in-depth view of their growth. I mean, to, to get a clear picture of each of your ambassador's businesses. Y'all think that's a big deal? Oh yeah. yeah. You also have this in all the rest of the business-related sections, like points and rank, where you have more KPIs at the top. What were my points last month? What are my points this month? Am I on track to reach my goals? This is also separated out into total points and outside leg points, as well as qualified ambassadors. It looks at who already has 100 PV, who's almost at 100 PV, who's fast start eligible. Yeah, below that, more sort report. Same thing here, we have the one, two click sorting and of course the Nikki Hinkle button. Okay, sorry, I'll stop. <laughs> PV, where's my PV coming from, and where do I need to focus? Who do I need to focus on? Tracks your commissions goals for you. Separates everything out into 100 and 500 PV categories. You also have commissions. You have rank advancements and a whole lot more. Everything in here is designed to give you your business wrapped up in a neat little package. Now, I know Julie and I have covered quite a lot in the past half hour, but we're just scratching the surface. Thank you so much to everyone who's been involved in this endeavor. With this new platform, we're not only pushing Plexus to the next level, we're setting the pace for the entire direct sales industry. Y'all as excited as I am?